Hello everyone, welcome back to Minecraft. So, a brand new experimental snapshot has been released for Minecraft 1.18 once again. This is the uh, fifth one. Um, it's kind of crazy, we got quite a few experimental snapshots already, and it's still August, so... Kind of crazy, I'm pretty sure this update isn't supposed to come out until like late this year, like December or something. I don't know, it said like holiday, so... Basically this summer, but anyways, yeah. Brand new experimental snapshot, and this one brings a whole lot of changes. Uh, just like experimental snapshot 4 and 3, 2 basically. No new like big features or anything, but... Um, they have introduced some very cool changes. A lot of them are minor, but uh, some of the big ones include... Um, uh, more peaks for the mountains, so... Uh, I'm pretty sure they had peaks before, but now they should have even taller and bigger peaks and stuff, so that's gonna be cool, and actually that's gonna be like the main thing I'm gonna try to find in this video, because peaks are cool, so we're gonna do that in this video, and then other changes include making mountains just bigger and larger and higher and stuff, um, some bug fixes, making swamps better, uh, making rivers slightly better and stuff, basically small changes to like world generation just to clean up like all the messy stuff and stuff, so, yeah, cool stuff, so, yes, I know I said stuff a lot, anyways, let's get into the world, so, we're just gonna be continuing in the same world here, uh, yep, I know what I'm doing, and, uh, yeah, so, the goal of this video is pretty much to find peakier peaks, uh, as, uh, as they're described, uh, in the snapshot, so, that's what we're gonna be doing, so, um, basically, if you don't know, the the new peaks, uh, basic, the like taller peaks and stuff, um, they can only generate in a, a few biomes, and they only sometimes generate, they don't always generate, and that is the, in the uh, lofty peaks, stony peaks, and very rarely the badlands as well. I've In creative mode, I have seen what the peaks look like um, in the lofty peaks, and the um, stony peaks, although I haven't seen the badlands, I'm not sure what the Badlands ones look like, but they're probably awesome, so... Yeah, but uh, today we're probably gonna try to look for some peaks in the uh, Lofty Peaks biome, because that's probably like the most likely place where we'll find the new peaks, so... Yeah, let's get going. So, if you remember from last video, came from that direction, there's like a huge floating island, which by the way, I'm pretty sure they have said they've decreased like the frequency of, like like completely shattered terrain like that so we should we probably won't be seeing too much of that anymore but um um yeah the peaks on the mountains and stuff those are much more dramatic so that's what we're going to check out okay so it looks like we have a boat already so that's good but before we go uh travel across that ocean i'm going to go to sleep which i have to wait a little bit for um some nice peaceful squid in the water. Cool. Not sure what we'll find beyond there, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be neat terrain since I don't think we've been in that direction before we came from that way. So hopefully we find some out soon because um, that's where the new peaks are going to be. All right. Sleep has been accomplished. Let's go in the boat and let's continue exploring. Okay, so it looks like uh, I've actually found myself a mountain range here. Now, I'm not sure if this is going to have the um, the lo lofty peaks biome and if it's going to have the uh, new jagged peaks generation with the lofty peaks, but uh, it does seem like a pretty wide mountain range, which is another new thing where um, basically the mountain biomes are now a lot wider and bigger than before, so... Uh, that's something we can still check out, and uh, basically the reason why there are a lot of uh, changes to the mountains in this snapshot is basically to make them more like the uh, mountains that we experienced in the uh, Bedrock Beta, like a couple months ago basically. Um, in the Bedrock Beta, the mountains are yeah a lot taller, bigger, and just a lot crazier in general. Um, so. That's why we're seeing all these mountain changes in the snapshot, which I'm happy with. I, I personally prefer the um, ooh, the uh, bedrock 
uh, beta mountains compared to the uh, Java style mountains that were in the previous snapshots. I think the snapshot does a good job in uh, bringing the two versions closer parity for uh, the mountain biomes. Though I still think a little more work could be done making like these mountains generate a lot taller and stuff because uh, yeah, it's not they're, they don't generate very tall like very often so I would like to see that a bit more. Also you should be careful a bit here because this is a uh, yeah, this is a grove biome, and grove biomes do have powder snow in them, so... Yeah, I don't think I have any leather, so... Yeah, no leather, so... I'm gonna have to watch my step. A lot of cool cave entrances here, though. So... It's cool. Although, we pretty much got, like, what we need f needed from the caves, so... We don't really need to go back in there. Also... Jungle biome, right next to mountain biome. That's... Probably not intentional, but... You know what? It's fine. Alright, okay, so looks like this mountain biome is not, oh jeez, well, this is the powder snow I was talking about, oh god, let's just take that away, okay, but um, yeah, so looks like this mount, uh, mountain area isn't as large as I was hoping, but I guess it's still pretty large, so that's something at least, um, but no peaky peaks, so that's kind of a shame, uh, let's see if we can see anything from up here um because uh, we have a pretty good view from up here so maybe we can see another mountain area maybe probably not though because it seems like this is the only one for here is that one no looks like uh what is that biome savannah oh is that oh that actually might mm, i'm not sure it kind of looks like a mountain biome but i think that might be sand up there which which would mean it's a desert, so... Oh, did not mean to do that. Whoopsies. Let's pull out our water bucket, just so... We have that on hand, and, uh... Let's, uh, check out that area, I guess. Because we might as well. We're still looking for those peaks, so... Yeah. So, as it turns out, uh, this place is kind of weird, actually. It's got, like, sand. So is this, like, desert? Yeah, it's like a desert biome. And a snowy slopes biome, like mixed with each other. I'm not sure why that is, um, but uh, at least we get a nice view from up here, so that's something. But yeah, uh, not another. There's no peaks up here, so it's just snowy slopes, which kind of suck. But at least we get a nice view up here, so let's sleep to that awesome view. And then in the morning, we will continue exploring. I did spot a. Uh, Another little high elevation area over there, so I'm gonna head over there and see if there are any peaks worth checking out. Because, uh, yeah, I want those peaks. Those peaks sound amazing, and I really want to see those amazing peaks. So, I'm gonna head this way. Uh, look at that cave entrance, though. Wow, that is gigantic. So, I'm noticing, hmm. Uh, it doesn't look like a completely, doesn't look like a, uh, complete mountain or anything. Like, it doesn't have any of the mountain biomes, I don't think. It just looks like, uh, plains. Uh, but, a really high elevation plains, so. Yeah, I might not attempt to, uh, climb that area, but look at this cave entrance, though. It just goes straight through the mountain. Quite crazy, honestly. Anyways. Yeah, so that doesn't seem like a mountain, so I'm just going to skip that, and uh, I'm just going to go c keep going this way. Hopefully I find another mountain peak, and uh, hopefully we can find some cool tall peaks over there. Uh, apparently the peaks can generate all the way up to like Y260 or something, and it's pretty unlikely I'll find a peak that goes up that high, but you never know. I might find one. But I, I mean, honestly, I'd be satisfied with any, like, peak, like, sharp peak that just goes, like, just decently high, even, like, Y200. Or even a little less than that, it's fine. It's gonna be still a lot taller than any of the terrain over here, so that's what I'm looking forward to, honestly. So, I haven't, I still haven't uh, found any, uh, mountain peaks or anything, but I did find this, uh, cool little Badlands area right here, uh, with... I think those might be peaks. I'm, I'm not sure. They look a lot like peaks. 
like in the distance over there, but I'm not sure. But anyways, it's a cool little eroded Badlands area over here, which are uh, kind of like thick little eroded areas. Like usually the eroded Badlands areas are like, they have like thin little, like, like thin, like jagged, like peaks and stuff. But these ones are kind of thick, which is kind of interesting. But um, it's a very small area too, which is interesting. But uh, yeah, I want to go over there because it seems like might be able to find some like actual peaks there, which I wasn't expecting at all. I thought I'd be able to find a uh, mountain peak um, in this video instead of a Badlands peak, but I might have just found myself a uh, Badlands peak here, so I'm going to check this out. So this uh, Badlands area is kind of a pain to climb. It's a little mountain mountainous terrain, but I'm trudging through it. And we're almost there at the top. And here we are. So, yeah, I'm not sure. Is that is that a peak? I mean, kind of got a really tall area over here. So, like, what? Well, yeah, we're at Y97. I mean, I guess that isn't that tall, but oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, are those some peaks? Those look like peaks, but I think that's like desert. And I don't, I don't think desert biomes are supposed to generate peaks. So I think that's just natural, but yeah, the over here, like that that thing over there, that looks a lot like a peak. Not gonna lie, and uh, it has been confirmed that Badlands can can generate with peaks. So it kind of looks like a peak to me. I don't know. And there's even more Badlands terrain over there, which is kind of awesome. And uh, another sunset you'll be able to witness from the top of this little plateau slash peak area. So that's pretty cool. Look how much taller this terrain is compared to the rest of the terrain. It's pretty awesome, not gonna lie. And I don't think we've had a view from um, a Badlands biome yet. We've mostly been checking out the mountain biomes. And I know we're trying to find the mountain biomes again today, but I don't know. We should probably spend some time here in the Badlands. It's very, I don't know about peaceful, but I don't know, it's just kind of a relaxing area to be. I mean, there's not much around. It's pretty barren, but still. Like, I don't know, it's a nice area. Anyways, you should probably sleep. See, I'm not sure, are these peaks or what? It's kind of weird. I think they might be, so. If we don't find any mountain biomes, I think I'll consider my, this video still a success, because I'd say we still found some peaks over here, so. That's still something. Anyways, how are we going to get over there? I guess we can try going this way. Um, because that river is very, like, down there. It's making all this terrain really steep, so... Definitely probably not going to go there. So, oops, throw away a torch. Where did, I, where did that torch go? Okay, whatever. Um, yeah, look at that. Look at that area over there. So, that is... Definitely not one of the peaks I'm looking for. It looks a lot like it, but it doesn't have the lofty peaks by him. Although it does have stony peaks, is that? I'm not sure, actually. Actually, that might be a stony peaks by him. I kind of see some terrain behind it, so these might actually be the peaks that I'm looking for. Because uh, not only can the peaks generate um, in lofty peaks, but they can also generate in uh, stony peaks as well, which is a new biome that they added quite recently in a few snapshots. I forgot which one. Experimental snapshot three maybe? Two? I, I don't remember exactly, but one of the recent ones. They added this biome and uh, they've actually made quite a few changes to it since then. Quite a lot of good changes. Like you can find calcite there now and now you can even find peaks there. It's, it's honestly not that bad of a biome to be in. So, and I think this might be the biome. It looks a lot like it, and usually stony peaks generate quite high, and in like a hot, uh, warm areas, and there is a jungle nearby, so. Yep, stony peaks. This is it, and we found ourselves some calcite too. We didn't, this was something I wanted to check out in the last video, but I couldn't, oh, hi goat. Didn't realize you spawned here too. Don't ram me. But, um, yeah, this is what I, something I wanted to check out in the last video, but I couldn't because there's no stony peaks nearby, but now we've actually found some, so let's get
get ourselves some calcite. Unfortunately, we cannot make it into any stairs or slabs or anything, which is kind of a shame because calcite is a very nice looking block. And making stairs out of this will be would be pretty awesome. So is this a peak? It's kind of hard to... I guess those are peaks. I'd say those are peaks. Who's some iron? And this is kind of a peak too, so I'd say this counts. I'd say this counts as a win. We didn't find any lofty peaks or anything, but honestly, I'll take this as a, as a peak right here. And stony peaks are way cooler, honestly. We've seen plenty of lofty peaks, like all over the place. Stony peaks are obviously way cooler, just because they're newer, obviously. And they have calcite, so... Like, that's basically the only reason why they're the best biome ever. Because they have calcite, so... Nothing can beat that. Nothing can top that. Unless they add calcite to the other, mo other mo mountain biomes, then... Stony peaks won't be that special anymore, but... For now, stony, stony peaks is pretty special. So we got ourselves enough calcite right here. This whole stack... I don't know what I'm going to do with it, probably nothing, because it's not, you can't really build much out of it, it's more of like a, like a decorative block you use in conjunction with other blocks, but it's nice to have anyways. But yes, I am standing on a stony peak right now, an actual peak, I am considering this a peak, even though it doesn't really look like it, ooh, emerald, let me just grab that, because emeralds are cool. Cute. All right. Anyways, I think this is going to be the end, end of the video here. I know we didn't really do much. It's mainly just exploring again, but honestly, these experimental snapshots are just like changing up the world generation. So there's not like much else I can do in survival. And I, I could start a new world every time they release a new snapshot, but uh, I don't know. I that's just not really fun to me. I I prefer just exploring once I have all these gear on me already so yeah that's why these videos are like this but glad we found a, a new this new stony peaks biome and all these uh, cool little things over here like that calcite area this big strip of granite so cool stuff and a peak here so yeah very cool stuff anyways this is gonna be the end of the video here hope you enjoyed uh, even though it was kind of a bit short but it is what it is. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, this is probably going to be my last video for quite a while since I am heading to college, like basically tomorrow. So, and actually, when this video goes up, it'll probably be going up on the day I actually move into college. So, wacky stuff. But um, yeah, this is probably going to be the last video for a while. So, uh, if a new experimental snapshot comes out next week or the week after, I probably won't cover it in a video until like a little later. So yeah, don't expect like, too much content for me for like the next couple of weeks or anything. But hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you guys have enjoyed all the videos on uh, Minecraft 1.18 so far. And I'll see you guys next time in quite a while, but next time. So yep, see ya.